Is nine one one? How many years have you been doing this now? Uh, six, five or six. Is it fun, or does it feel like it's just sort of like for me after season four or five? It started to like go. Okay, this is redundant. I'm doing the same thing. I know what I'm doing here. It's kind of the. Or does it get because you have a complicated, you know, uh, character yeah. and relationships and stuff like that. So is it something that you truly enjoy still doing, or you're like you're ready to move on to the next thing? You know, <clears throat> I do still enjoy doing it. I love the people. I've been very lucky to have this job. Um, it's It sounds awful because it, it was so much work. But like my character started off so in so much turmoil mm -hmm. and so much drama and so much trouble and everything that it was so fun to play. But then the audience really wanted her to get like happy and kind of normalized again. And that part is hard for me because I really liked, I really liked playing. I really, I, it was the, one of the first times that I didn't have to just play like the happy, sweet, nice girl. You know what I mean? And so I, I miss, I miss Maddie's turmoil a little bit, which sounds awful to say, because you should want for, you know, people to be happy and, and joyful. Um, but I do miss her turmoil a little bit. So, um, it's, it's still an amazing job that I love doing, but I do miss, I do miss that. So I'm, I'm always like, can we, can we have something get messed up again? Like, <laughs> you she know, screw up another 911 call and it'd be her fault. And then she has to report to the, you know, yeah, something I told I her, love, I told I her to her. get the gun and then she shot herself. It was, a, it was my mistake. <laughs> I, I don't know what I was thinking. And then you go into <laughs> alcoholism and have to go to AA and you're really yeah, upset something. about this. Just, and you visit I the mom and you're. How, I love how her issues always come up. And, and we have done like last season was sort of an issueless season for her. Um, and so I'm, I'm hoping that in this next one, maybe we can, you know, they can come back again. Just, just a little every now and then. Cause it's fun for me. They're hard days when I have to do all that, but I secretly love it. Um, so I think that that would be, that would be fun. And then I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm ready for like my Christmas movie era. Wait you know, a minute. You want to start doing Hallmark? I mean, I don't know. Like lifetime. Like, I don't know. I just have never. And you love I've Christmas. Never done, I've never done the Christmas. Thing. I have so many friends that have done those and they love them. I want to do it. Erica Durant, so Amanda Klutz, like, Pete, yes. like they love doing them. And it's fun and you could write your own if you want I and you could produce and you could do all that, you you know. So I'm ready to step into like my Christmas movie era too. And I feel like some of my friends are like, no, that's what happens when you're in your forties and you go do Christmas movies. And I'm like, but I am in my forties and I want to do Christmas movies. <laughs> so I'm kind of looking forward to doing something like that. Maybe after 911 to kind of, you know be like emergencies and then joy well i can't maybe think about like if you do a christmas story maybe i'm your alcoholic brother. why don't you come direct a, why don't you come direct a christmas movie I, I would do that if you were in it i would do we'd have a blast oh, that would be fun. i would do that i would do it if it was fun and it was like you know just for, yeah, yeah. Would, you, would you be like the the guy in a christmas movie i'd like to be the alcoholic brother that kind of gets oh, a shit, okay. to, gets a shit not, together that's, at the end. that's not done a lot no i'm kidding i, I I could be, how about the guy that you don't think she's going to end up with? Like the guy that, yeah. the delivery guy. I'm delivering Amazon yeah, the all the time. I'm the delivering Am Christmas. Yeah, I'm delivering Amazon packages all the time. And I'm just like, hey, great. And you're like, hey, would you mind putting that out there? Blah, blah, blah. Oh, you know, I'll take care of that for you. I'll do that. Hey, you look really nice today, Mrs. Uh, uh, Johnson. And, uh, you know, all of a sudden you're like, he's really nice and he's cute, but he's the delivery guy. I, I don't know if I can. And then I say, you know. I'm actually a millionaire. I just do this for fun. We should hang out. I'm reconsidering. <laughs> I'm reconsidering my offers. Yeah. <laughs> it's a Christmas bad idea. Movie. I've really blown I'm it. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Have you ever seen a Christmas movie? A uh, Christmas story. Um, Christmas vacation. I okay. I haven't seen it any it's lifetimes. Classic. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta watch like the, like, you know, send me one, whole... send me one that you think I, is good. You should watch Amanda's. It's great. Oh, I did see fit some of that. And I liked it. She did a really good job. Fit for, fit for Christmas. Yeah, she's great. That's right. That's great. I did see that. And that Anna was White good. Wrote it, who's amazing, and also my friend. So proud. Of okay, her. Anyway, Amanda, that's Amanda's it. fantastic. Wait, didn't she's you introduce me to her? Yes. 